I'm Maeve and today I'm going to be looking all around my garden for ground living mini beasts. One of my favourite types of mini beasts is the woodlouse, also sometimes known as slaters, and they're part of a bigger group of animals called crustaceans. Shortly I'm going to show you how you can make your very own woodlouse. All you will need is a toilet roll tube, some scissors, print stick, a pencil, black marker and some white paper or card so you can make your eyes. So your first step is to draw your woodlouse shape on your toilet roll tube. It doesn't have to be perfect but just make sure that you draw your lines just above half of the toilet roll tube because we're going to use the other part later for the rest of the body and the legs. Then when you've done that, draw on about six lines to make your segments. Now in real life, would lice have a few more segments than this. This is just to make it easier for us. So now we need to cut out the woodlouse shape. And once you've done that, cut a little slit at each of the lines on both sides of the woodlouse. And when you've done that, fold up each little flap where you've made the slits so that they're roughly along the same line, the same on the other side. So next, take your bit that you've just cut out and place it on the leftover part of toilet roll tube. So we're going to trace around this, but make sure to trace underneath the little flaps. And we're going to draw seven legs on each side. So you can do them coming out of each segment. rough enough because the flaps cover most of it when we put it on. And then do the same on the other side. And then you want to cut out your shape. Now this part can be a wee bit tricky, so get an adult to help you if you need to.
So now we need to glue our two pieces together. And then if you get some white paper or card, draw on some eyes with your black marker and glue, then glue them on. and leave a little room to draw on your mouth. So next, take your leftover pieces of toilet roll tube, or you can use another one if you don't have enough space. And we want to draw on some antennae for our woodlouse. And they use these to feel their way around. So I've just done mine in a sort of lightning bolt shape, like this. And then I want to cut these out. And then we want to glue them on just above the eyes. Woodlice have two little tail-like parts that just stick out at the back of their body and they're called uropods. So I'm just going to draw two thin triangles and we can stick these on. They use these uropods to release a horrible smelling substance when they're being attacked. And as well as that, when they're thirsty, they use these to take up water. So we'll just cut these out. And take your glue. And stick them on. that's us all finished. So why not try it and make your own wood louse at home? Thanks so much for joining us and happy mini beast hunting!